simple about the capital structure and dividend policy. Okay, now our last chapter of our corporate finance syllabus is the business risk and financial risk. Business risk and financial risk. Now this you are well aware about the risk. This means uncertainty. Say for example, ten percent. 
If company earns 20 percent return on capital employed, say for example, two crore rupees, what will happen? They will get the at least 20 percent, 24 lakhs. But 50 percent is the net capital. One crore ka, that is one crore. One crore ka 7 percent. Only 7 lakh they have to pay to whom? To the net capital. Even on two lakh, that means one crore also company earns 20 percent, but they are only obliged to pay 7 percent. How much amount we left with the company? 24 lakh minus 7 lakh. That means 17 lakhs. 1 crore ka 10 percent, 10 lakhs. But equity shareholder will get 17 lakhs. Because whatever left over, that is available to the shareholder. I said you said that 7 lakhs are available to the shareholder. Though their expectation is 10 percent because they are distributed. This is known as ready money. Contribution 30 
ट्वेंटी लैक्स और अर्निंग बिल्कुल इंटरेस्ट टैक्स कितना है फिफ्टीन लैक्स तो हमारा एवरेज कितना आएगा वन वेरी सिंपल वन ओके नेक्स्ट फाइनेंशियल एवरेज अर्निंग बिफोर इंटरेस्ट एंड टैक्स फिफ्टीन लैक्स डिवाइडेड बाई ट्वेल्व लैक्स अगर ये आप कैलकुलेट करोगे फिफ्टीन लैक्स डिवाइडेड बाई ट्वेल्व लैक्स इट मीन कस वन पॉइंट ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड कंपाइन एवरेज फॉर्मूला जस्ट थर्टी लैक्स डिवाइडेड बाई ट्वेल्व लैक्स इट मीन कम टू पॉइंट करेक्ट इट मीन कम टू पॉइंट सो स्टूडेंट्स ने दो दिन बहुत इजी अभी लास्ट सवाल एक उन्होंने बताया है कैलकुलेट अर्निंग पर शेयर तो अर्निंग पर शेयर कैलकुलेट करना उतना डिफिकल्ट नहीं है अर्निंग पर शेयर मींस प्रॉफिट अवेलेबल टू इक्विटी शेयर होल्डर व्हिच वी हैव कैलकुलेटेड इट लाइक फॉर्मिंग ऑफ द डिवाइडेड बाय नंबर ऑफ इक्विटी शेयर्स स्टूडेंट्स वी आर हैविंग टोटल शेयर कैपिटल ऑफ ₹40 लैक्स ईच शेयर इज ऑफ ₹10 ₹40 लैक्स डिवाइडेड बाय 10 मींस 4 लैक्स इट लाइक फॉर्मिंग ऑफ द डिवाइडेड बाय 4 सो इट विल कम टू पॉइंट Financial 
week before interest and tax divided by earning before tax. So here the answer will be two lakh fifty divided by two lakh twenty six. Answer is one point eleven. Okay, I have done. Twelve lakh twenty five thousand. Divided by eleven lakh forty seven thousand. So the answer. Divided by two lakh twenty six thousand, our answer will be like S two point sixty six. Here twenty six lakh twenty five thousand divided by eleven lakh forty seven thousand, you get the answer S two point twenty. This is the answer. Okay, very easy. Just we have to put the information in the formula. Already the structure we have done. One more question is there, question number eleven, which is many times asked in the university. Question number eleven, we will discuss. A company has the following balance sheet as on March thirty first, two thousand fourteen. Equity share capital, one crore shares of rupees ten crores, number of shares also given, reserve surplus given, fifteen percent debentures given, current liability is given, fixed assets and current assets also given. Balance sheet carry forty crore rupees. Fixed cost excluding interest is given eight crores. We can calculate the interest cost because they have given us the debenture. So twenty crores into fifteen percentage, so three crore rupees is interest cost here. Variable operating cost ratio is given sixty five percent. Variable operating cost ratio. This other one hundred and three sixty five. Contribution is given thirty five percent. This QB ratio thirty five percent. As I am calculating percent. Total assets turnover ratio is two point five. Asset turnover Because the asset turnover ratio is equal to sales divided by total asset. Total asset is 40 crore. Or we have a turnover ratio of 2.5 times. Means 40 crore into 2.5 means 100 crore is our total. Yes. Sales income tax is given 40 percent. Calculate EPS, operating leverage, financial leverage, and combined leverage. So we have four ways to calculate. Yes, 
learning before interest rate and you can put it in your table which comes around 1.3 financial leverage financial leverage kya hai bhai yes epat divided by ebt 27 divided by 24 so the information is free we come around 1.13 and combined leverage combined leverage answer is a contribution divided by ebt yes 24 so it will come Only 
is at what level EBT of the pump will be equal to zero? EBT is zero. एक zero का हो जाएगा. Nothing but one financial breakdown. ये आपको financial breakdown point पर calculate करेंगे. तो हमारा breakdown point का formula क्या है? Total fixed cost. Fixed cost divided by accumulation. आपको मिल गया. अभी हम लोग मान लें हमारा फिक्स कॉस्ट है सिक्स लैक्स ऑपरेटिंग एंड इंटरेस्ट फोर लैक फाइव थाउजेंड एंड टोटल टेन लैक फाइव थाउजेंड टेन लैक फाइव थाउजेंड डिवाइडेड बाय यस फोर्टी फोर थाउजेंड फोर्टी फोर परसेंट अगर आप कंप्लीट करते तो आपको मिल जाएगा यस ट्वेंटी टू लैक्स एटी फोर अगर कंपनी 22 लैक्स 84 तो अपने आराम 23 लैक्स कमा लिए डेफिनेस कंपनी को अर्निंग तो थोड़ा टैक्स नहीं लाए तो कम से कम कंपनी का सेल्स इतना रहना ही चाहिए डेट इस वर्किंग पर बहुत मायने रखती है वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट क्वेश्चन इट वाज आस्क इन सेवरल एक्टर एक्सामिनेशन एंड प्रोफेशनल एक्सामिनेशन 